Hi friends, in this video we are solving problems on Taylor series expansion. Given problem is expand log x base e in powers of x minus 1 and hence evaluate log of 1.1 correct to 4 decimal places. Okay. First I am writing the given function as f of x is equal to log x base e. Now we have to expand this function about x is equal to 1 or simply expand in powers of x minus 1. Okay. After that what we have to do? We have to evaluate log of 1.1. Anyhow friends, first I am verifying log of 1.1 value by using the calculator. Okay. Now, now we are finding log 1.1 value by using calculator friends log base they are given so you have to press ln of 1.1 which is equivalent to 0 0.09531017798 actually up to four decimal places only we required so first you note down this one later we will verify our resulting value with the calculator okay friends so first i am writing log of 1.1 value one side this is the log of 1.1 Okay, now coming to the solution, given function f of x is equal to log x, we have to expand in powers of x minus 1, that is about x is equal to 1, we have to do. Okay, first I am writing the Taylor series expansion of f of x about x is equal to a, we have f of a plus x minus a into f dash of a plus x minus a whole square by 2 factorial into f double dash of a plus x minus a whole to the power of 3 by 3 factorial into f triple dash of a plus x minus a whole to the power of 4 by 4 factorial into f fourth derivative of a plus so on. Okay friends, now where we are discussing about x is equal to 1 that is in powers of x minus 1. So put x is equal to a that is a is equal to 1. So f of x is equal to f of 1 plus x minus 1 times of f dash of 1 plus x minus 1 whole square by 2 factorial into f double dash of 1 plus x minus 1 whole cube by 3 factorial into f triple dash of 1 plus x minus 1 whole to the power of 4 by 4 factorial into f fourth derivative of 1 plus so on. Okay friends. So, here what you need to find? f of 1, f dash of 1, f double dash of 1, f triple dash, f fourth derivative. Okay friends. Now, we are differentiating given f of x with respect to x. The first derivative of f of x is f dash of x. That is log x derivative is 1 by x. Friends, you can also write this as x inverse. It's not an issue. Okay for our convenience. Now, f da double dash of x, that is, x inverse means x power minus 1. What is x power n derivative? x power n derivative is n into x to the power of n minus 1. So, you will have minus x to the power of minus 1 minus 1 means minus 2. Now, f triple dash of x value is, here uh, negative is there, already n is also negative, so minus into minus plus. So, this will be 2 into x power minus 3. Next, f fourth derivative is minus here you have a 2, here you have a minus 3, so minus 6 into x to the power of minus 4. Now I required a f of x values and the derivatives values at x is equal to 1. So at x is equal to 1, f of 1 value is log 1. What is the log 1 value? 0. Next f dash of 1 is 1 inverse. 1 inverse is nothing but 1 only. f double dash of 1 is minus 1 square. Minus 1 square is minus 1 f triple dash of 1 is min 2 to the power of 1 power minus 3. 1 power minus 3 is nothing but what? 2 only. Minus uh, 1 power negative is also 1 only. Okay. Next, f fourth derivative at x is equal to 1 is minus 6 into 1 power minus 4 is 1 only. So, the values finally I am writing here. f of, f of 1 is 0. f dash of 1 is 1. f double dash of 1 is minus 1 f triple dash of 1 is 2, f fourth derivative is minus 6. Now we have to substitute these all values in the evo equation. I am considering this as a equation 1. So if you substituted all values, then we are getting log 
x is equal to what is f of 1? 0 plus x minus 1 times of f dash of 1. What is f dash of 1 we have? 1 plus x minus 1 whole square by 2 factorial into f double dash of 1 is what I have? Minus 1 plus x minus 1 whole cube by 3 factorial into f double dash of 4 completed. Now f triple dash is 2 plus x minus 1 whole to the power of 4 by 4 factorial into f fourth derivative 1 is what? Minus 6 plus so on. So now you have to simplify this. Then you will have this is x minus 1 times of 1 means x minus 1 only. And here you have a negative sign. Here you have a positive sign. So x minus 1 whole square by 2 factorial is nothing but 2. Next year you have positive, here also positive. So this will be positive. What you can add 3 factorial as 3 into 2. So this factorial and 2 getting cancelled. Then you will have x minus 1 whole cube by 3 only. Next year you have a 6. Actually 4 factorial you can add as 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. So here you have a 6. So this 6 and uh, uh, these are getting cancelled. Then negative into positive is negative. Then it will be x minus 1 whole to the power of 4 by 4 factorial remaining term what I have 4 only so write down 4 and plus so on now you observe friends given a function log x we are expanded in powers of x minus 1 or else you can also say log x we are expanded about x is equal to 1 now we have to go for verification verification means just we are finding log of 1.1 .1 value log of 1.1 value you required so I am substituting x is equal to 1.1 so put x is equal to 1.1 in the above equation then you will have log of 1.1 is equal to this is 1.1 minus 1 is what actually 0 0.1 so 0 0.1 minus 0 0.1 whole square by 2 plus 0 0.1 whole cube by 3 minus 0 0.1 whole to the power of 4 by 4 plus so on. Now log of 1.1 is equal to 0 0.1 minus 0 0.1 whole square is 0 0.1 whole square is equal to 0 0.01. Now divided by 2 is 0 0.005. Now 0 0.1 whole cube is we have 0 0.001 divided by 3 if I done then I will have 0 0.0003 and uh, 0 0.1 whole power 4 is 0 0.1 whole to the power of 4 is 0 0.0001 if I divide it by 2 then I will have 0 0.000025 okay friends now on simplifying then I will have 0 0.09531 and so on okay friends so this is the log of 1.1 value so our uh, result value and uh, calculated value both are equal up to four decimal places is it clear friends right thank you for watching this video